the good thing for the Hoosiers is that they have the fewest turnovers of all Elite Eight teams coming into today. From the big timers on the court next door to the first timers here. Adonio Hillary plays the game low to high, Beth, and she is right there on the dribble and on the catch. Stuffed on the drive by Ben Yaney. You want to talk about an emotional night? Who's gonna get the first one to the bottom of the net? They're a combined 0 for 10 to start. Sam Thomas. She can just get to the free throw line. She can rebound. She's terrific on the defensive end. Back to back. Pac-12 first team all defensive. Here she is on Berger. Grace gets the blow by for the lay-in. McDonald gets loose underneath for the lay-in. That's an excellent find by Kate Reese. You know, sometimes in the first quarter, you bring two to the ball and set some ball screen action because you're trying to see how Arizona's going to handle it. We know they're going to trap that ball screen action. That's what she did for Allie Patberg. McDonald got the three, so she hit six the last game. More dangerous than she is actually taking threes. Right here, see, she creates separation off the bounce, gets the switch watching her run to the Elite Eight, but today when we talked to Adia, she stressed the importance of former WNBA players getting opportunities to coach college basketball. And if you look at one-fourth of the field of the Elite Eight, you would say she's onto something as both Barnes and Don Staley. In the Elite Eight, played at a high level in the college game and then pursued careers in coaching and a couple of them after their WNBA careers. Yeah, they, they have good offensive maturity. They know where their shots come from. That's why they don't turn the ball over. McDonald, boy, the momentum of a big three-point shooting barrage a couple nights ago is carried over. I mean, can she carry this team all the way to the final four? She has been traveled or double dribble, either one. Shot clock winding down for Pat. That's what I'm talking about. Deep into the shot clock, being able to make a play. Allie Patberg off the bounce. She's their emotional leader. It's a busted play, broken play, and she keeps her eyes on the prize to finish at the rim. Goes to the right, then comes back to the left. Shayna Pellington elevates and scores. And that'll do it for the first quarter. Of course, always good to remember, even though that is a lot of the talk right now, that was a fabulous basketball yes, game. Yes, it by was. Two teams filled with Warriors. <laughs> Allie Patberg. Oh, oh, nice no nice. look pass. Good dish to Mackenzie Holmes. And her head coach, Terry Moran, they are both Indiana natives. Allie from Columbus, Indiana as they score again inside. See how they run everything for Ari to get to her left hand. Oh, off the backboard for three. I don't know if there was oh. anything Nikki could have done better on defense. Come on now. Reese on a hard drive to the right. And one. Yeah, through contact. And for Arizona, a whole lot of Ari McDonald so far. The pull-up mid-range, that's why her coach says she's got the best one in the business. A third turnover for Indiana. And oh, there's that snake and bake you were talking about from Ari. There's the snake. And Pat Blair pushing her out. Pat Bird kept that dribble alive. Holmes weak side rebound. She'll give it a go and wrap it around the bottom. There she goes again, weaving her way to the rim. Back to back, excuse me, she did score on that snake before. That's another snake right there. She always gets back to that left hand. It's really hard. Off of a 31 point performance in the Sweet 16. Good oh. wraparound pass and a fine from Berger to Holmes. Cuello. Weak side, Reese. She'll put it up off the window with contact. Really good finish. Four of 18 for 10 points in that first half. As she told LaChina Robinson, uh, they need to give her a little help. And there you go. On cue, Baptiste. It's 10 points for Mackenzie Holmes on the inside. Here she is. Trying to beat the double team. Goes to the left hand. Again, through contact. 
the defender, uh, Cardano Hillary, uh, oh, unable to cool down Ari McDonald, another three. Come on, Ari McDonald, you go ahead and shoot till your arm falls off. <laughs> Largest lead for the Wildcats. I think you gotta go under. She's too dangerous when she gets in the paint because she can do this. Oh, what a play, the block, and then the save by Goulbe. She said, when you're little, your defense and your speed and your toughness, those are the things that set you apart, and she has been set apart. That means your handle's got to be tight, and you got to be able to make every shot. Runners, floaters, and have great range, and Ari McDonald's got all of it. Hackberg had a go with our Ari that trip. Well, they're switching now in their yeah. ball screen action, Beth, because they just couldn't guard her at one-on-one, -on -one, and Mackenzie Holmes doing a great job. Dana Pellington. McDonald, good vision to find Thomas cross court. And then Baptiste is on the board. Short corner, good. Atberg off the bounce. Switch to the right hand in midair and midair. Oh, oh, what a tough bucket. A lot of tough twos out here tonight. Kate Reese. Thomas spots up in transition for the three. How much fun would Aaron McDonald be to play with in the deep corner? Holmes gets the basket on the block. Aaron McDonald off the ball. But going back to her left, she's got it. And gets it up and over Holmes. Great dribble drive action. Good change of pace by Arizona in the quarter court offensively. 22 for McDonald. 40 minutes of full court pressure by Arizona defensively. Good nice home. catch by Holmes. I tell you what, she can catch everything and she shapes up to the ball nicely. Weak side, Cuello, no. And McDonald comes in and steals it right away from Cardano Hillary. You want to talk about quicks? Wow. Also, Terry won the 2018 WNIT title. And Adia Barnes has got one of those as well. Baptiste. Boy, they have just been fantastic from downtown in the NCAA tournament. She wants to go to work on Baptiste. Those two have been jawing a little bit at one another. And there's the pull up and the stare. Trinity. You can see that one coming for a few possessions. The kick out, Pueo nails the triple. Remember, Harry told the China. Kate Reese is so good at the Reese screen. Oh, she was able to lose Cardano Hillary with the change of direction. 27. And, her, and Harry reads it so well. 11 threes the last two games. Berger, beautiful looking mid-range jumper. Five minutes to go. Indiana just one team foul. Just something to keep your eye on. Way a wide open. Assist on the drive by McDonald. Need a bucket. Haven't had one in three and a half minutes since she elevates and hits. We're gonna try and run two at McDonald to make her give it up. Thomas, loose ball. Oh, what a play. play. What a play to Yaney. With the push to her teammate. This is so good right here. Watch Sam Thomas almost loses the handle. I thought Papper was going to dive for that one. Offensive rebound in the street by McDonald to come out with it. The race is on. McDonald and one for Harry. For the first time in school history, the Arizona Wildcats.